Welcome to today's broadcast. No matter what kind of day you're having, please remember that God is big and God is good. He is bigger and better than you think. We have a relationship with God that the people living under the Old Covenant simply did not have. And they live with feelings of guilt, a conscience of sins. The blood of bulls and goats, all that blood, did not take away their sins. Those sacrifices only covered their sins. They were very much aware that underneath this covering, they were still sinners. I believe they lived with a certain amount of fear that if they made a wrong move, God's covering might slip out of place and expose their sinful nature to His wrath. I am convinced that most of us under this new covenant of grace live as if we were still under the old covenant of the law. We act as if Jesus is just a covering for our sins and we are afraid to do much moving around for fear of having our naked sinful self exposed to God's displeasure. We wear Jesus like an ill-fitting costume, afraid that if we make any risky move of faith, we might become exposed for who we really are. But Jesus did not cover our sins. He took them away. He took them away. Behold the Lamb of God who takes away the sin of the world, we read in John 1, 29. Yes, we have a sin, sinful human nature that, if permitted, naturally behaves badly. But we are not our human nature. We are spiritual men and women who no longer have to be subject to our human nature. We read in Galatians 5:16. But I say, walk and live habitually in the Holy Spirit, responsive to and controlled and guided by the Spirit. Then you will certainly not gratify the cravings and desires of the flesh, of human nature without God. So move boldly in faith, knowing when you expose yourself, you are exposing Christ in you, the hope of glory. For more, visit GiveMeThatMountain.org and have a great day.